Prince Harry has been filmed showing off his surfing skills with a master coach. The Duke of Sussex was captured chasing waves at an exclusive ranch in California. He navigated the waters at surfing legend Kelly Slater's Surf Ranch in Lemur, over 100 miles from the ocean. The video was posted to Tahiti-based pro surfer Raimana Van Bastolaire's Instagram account. Harry is seen in the clip taming the wave, with the caption reading, In Tahiti, we still call you Prince Harry. But at Surf Ranch, it's my brother. It was an honor to have you surf with me and Kelly Slater. Fans said in response he is living his California dream life and implied such passions will mean hell never come back to the UK. The Duke, 40, begins by riding on the board alongside Van Bastolaire's jet ski. Then he pulls away and leaps up onto his feet as the wave builds. The pro gives Harry instructions as he finds his balance and rides the man-made six-feet barreling wave for almost one minute. It is the central feature of Slater's Ranch, and stretches for 2,300 feet. It is the only such artificial wave to receive World Surf League accreditation. Harry relocated to California in 2020 with wife Meghan Markle. She is understood to have bought him surf lessons for his 36th birthday. The Duke has also been seen since cycling along Malibu's famous surf rider beach. Impressed fans have become obsessed with Harry's new surfing skills. On the social media platform X, at Flea Girl simply wrote, Prince Harry in America living his California dream life. Another said, Prince Harry, the Duke of Sussex surfing and thriving in California. A third said, Is there anything this man can't do? Hashtag Prince Harry is a true Californian now and this is supposed to be the man who's plotting to come back to the UK? One fan exclaimed, Meghan's man, aka Prince Harry, is full of surprises. He's an honorary Californian now. Another royal fan was in shock at the sight of the prince on the California waves. They said, I can't believe I wake up to this, Prince Harry surfing. Man, I mean wow. He appears to have become close friends with Slater and Van Bastolaire during his time in the U.S.